So in my role as system support specialist at the co-op, um, I'll be working with our area district and building leaders and we'll sit down and we'll look at the assessment data, specific, like all of the assessment data, but in terms of the summative assessment data, we would look at it and determine, you know, those high level potential gaps in curriculum and instruction, but also uh, the strengths of the curriculum instruction that they have in place within their districts, within their buildings. So I've been very fortunate to be able to uh, be in the, the whole process from the beginning to the end. So it's been about a year long process. And um, I started with item writing, item development. Um, I've been able to help in content review, which is what I'm doing now, and I've, I've done it in the past as well, um, but then also the standard setting. And it has really um, been, a, been a great process to be a part of, and it's really helped me grow professionally, I believe. So I'm gonna say the biggest thing for me um, is that it's 100% aligned to our standards. And that's a big thing for teachers and students in Arkansas. Um, it's much easier in my role um, to be able to communicate to teachers that if you teach the standards and if you know the standards well, then you don't have to worry about the assessment. Um, and that's really what I try to get out there to the, to the principals, to the teachers, is just know your standards teach them well, use your HQIM the way you're supposed to, uh, but make those decisions with your curriculum based on your standards and the performance of your students are going to be, is gonna be fine on the assessment.